everybody. We're at the lab sanding process. We're using the P800 thread. Here it is. What we're doing is we're taking any trash out of this. We need three more layers of clear on it. See? This process, you take the 800, you block it, and you take all the orange peel away. Do all your flat areas with a stiff block, soft block, round areas, contours, and edges by hand. You know, like this, as a contour. See what I'm saying? Now, this is how it does with a swipe or two. See the nice dull? It's all nice and dull right here. That's what you're looking for. And dull. Take this down some more, even. Try to take most of this little bit. Of, these are little baby eyes and stuff like that. Take them down as low as we can go. And then what we're going to do is lay a couple more layers of fill all that, bring it up higher, and we'll knock it off. The idea is here is you put three layers, bring it down as much as you can, and take as much of this as you all can out and all the trash out. Then you bring it up higher with three more layers and do it again. And when it's all gone, on the next layers, you ensure you have a clear shell over top of everything. That's the idea. So you know, do three layers, then another three, and you're done sanding in between the first three, and then the second three, you left at least three layers of clear over the car. That's what you do. You see here? Sparkles into it. But like right here, that is a piece of trash. Get that stuff out. All right, let me get at it, everybody. You can see we've already done that half of the hood. Lightly sand it, get it all nice and dull, and see how low we need more to go get the orange peel off and the trash and all the things out. Once again, I'll explain it one more second time. What you're going to do after that, you're going to lay three more layers of the clear over it and make it really wet again. And you're going to bring it down with a process of 1500 up to 3000 and then into your grits and polishes, uh, scratch removers and all that have the grit into it, and the, you know, polishing compound all that so you just want to take all this out make this super smooth that's all we're doing here we could technically you could do this and then repolish it but your clear coat is going to be so thin to the color if you ever had an issue you could never buff cut it again so by putting at least six layers and doing it you can ensure if you ever say scratch the car real bad you could buff that whole area out with grit and bring it back to a polish and ensure you're not cutting through the clear coat that's the idea Otherwise, right now, you'd be just go ahead and do this. Once it's all the trash is removed and it's all perfectly dull, go ahead and polish it back to a shine. But we're going to go with extra couple layers. All right, everyone. That ensures you a lot more silkier, smoother glass finish, too. So We'll be back. Like, share, subscribe.